Welcome back to Josiah Plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. I'm going to go in here and talk to see if I can find this detective and talk to him about uh, about what happened with Megan's death. I wonder if this is him? That's him. He's just chilling right here at a desk in front of the... Oh, that's right, because he's a security guard here now, they're, call they're saying. So he's literally running security at the front desk. Well, hold on. Let me just... Boxes. Very useful given all of the all of the jumping around onto stuff that I've been trying to do. Huh. Nice. So they're fragile. So you know what? Just jumping on them. Look, it, it lowered its health bar a little bit, so you can only use these. Oh, they might have already been that way. I don't know. It's like some smoke in the air here. I was crouched for some reason. Smoke. What else is going on here? It's a door I can just open. Well, okay. I, I don't need to run through this whole building just yet. I should go down here and talk to this guy. Alright, Detective Chase. Hiding anything? Okay, I guess not. I'm gonna chat him up. Oh, oh, shit. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Sorry. Ignore that. Hello there. Well, you must be Adam Jensen. A keen observation. Mrs. Reed told me you might pay me a visit. And don't take this the wrong way, but you're kind of hard to miss. I'll try to take that as a compliment. She told me you might have information regarding Megan Reed's case and the attack on Seraph headquarters. Oh boy, what a mess. Total pissing match. We had the feds on our ass, orders from three different departments, and pressure from so many lobbyists it felt like being the scrawny new kid in the prison shower. It is a very <laughs> high-profile case. Mrs. Reed said you thought some procedures were overlooked. You got that right. I mean, you know how it is. Mrs. Reed told me you used to be a cop. There's always cases where you see the lazy officers taking shortcuts. But this... this was different. Different how? Too much stuff got overlooked. People seemed way too eager to jump to conclusions, and every time I was remotely insistent, I got turned down by ranking officers. People wanted to bury this thing fast. That's never a good sign. Surely you have something more substantial than this. Yeah, well, that's where you come in. I got a couple of leads I could never fully investigate. I started poking around, but these government-type agents just gave me the creeps. So I got scared. Months hmm. away from retirement, I didn't want to fuck things up. But you? You obviously have the means to get to the bottom of this. So what have you got? First off, there's a rumor that the order to close the investigation came from higher up. Maybe even outside the local uh -huh. department. Uh-huh. Anything like that would have passed through Captain Penn. There might be traces of this left on his office computer. <laughs> Guess I'll have to pay a visit to the local precinct. Well, well, while you're there, there was an officer assigned to the case, Chet Wagner. He's not what you call a choir boy. And when he suddenly got brought on the case, I got suspicious. Somebody wanted him there. And I'm pretty sure he tampered with some of the evidence. You should talk to him. Find out what he knows. Okay, I'll have a little chat with Officer Wagner. You'll most likely find him in the lobby. He got retrograded from his conduct, and he takes depositions now. He won't budge easily, but I'm pretty sure you can find some dirt on him on his desktop. His office is on the third floor. You might find something there to help loosen up his tongue. Anything else worth looking into? Interesting. Yeah, when the order came down to close the case, the bulk of the evidence was stashed in a storage locker. Maybe you can find some interesting stuff in there. It's on the alley right next to the station. The code is 40... 4891. But I know an outside agency had access to that locker, so be careful. Thanks for the heads up. Bah, it's, it's nothing. And, uh, oh, uh, please. Don't bother coming back here with details. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad to help. But the less I know about this case, the better I'll feel. Wow. So he just gave me a ton of information. There's like three separate leads to follow up on on this thing. And you notice my new implant, I was picking up his personality type sometimes as he was talking. Uh, different 
ones of these were lighting up. That was kind of interesting. Um, so I don't know if I'll be able to leverage that with this guy or not, but uh, let's see here. How'd you get assigned to this case? Why retire? Outside agency may have tampered. How did you get assigned to this case? I didn't push for it, if that's what you mean. To be honest, I didn't want to get involved. Why not? I was an honest cop, Jensen. I always tried to conduct myself in accordance with the law, with procedures, and what I believed was right. Not really the standard M.O. for a case like this. Hmm. Why retire from the force only to become a security guard? I mean, it looks like you still love the work. I love the idea of being a cop. Ever since I was a kid, I wanted to join the force. But I just got fed up. It's not like I had imagined it. It's a job. Some people are good at it, while others just don't care. And it shows. This case, the Seraph case, it was just the last drop in a cup already full. Well, it's too bad this guy kind of got a little bit screwed. What's up you with this? You said the agency may have tampered with the storage locker. What did you mean by that? Well, I've seen, uh, I mean, I've heard that government agents may have locked up some of the more sensitive evidence in a safe inside the locker. Come on, Chase. What are you not telling me? Damn it! Okay, listen. I snooped around that locker before and found the safe code. But I kinda got caught by one of those guys. He knows I know, Jensen. If I give you the code, they'll know I talked. Call me negative, but I can't think of a nice outcome to that. Hmm. Oh! Cool. I get a chance to... I can... Oh, that's awesome. I can activate my pheromones and convince him to give me more information. Pheromones used. Convince. Convince Jace to give you the safe code. Appease. Alphas can be appeased, but betas will be angered. Ch betas can be appealed to, but the low self-esteem of omegas will make them very suspicious of this kind of approach. Omegas are susceptible to pressure but alphas are quick to rebel against it. So he was mostly a beta more than anything else. But he was also somewhat of an omega. But he was mostly a beta, so let's use this. Come on, Chase. You're the good guy, the honest cop. In a police flick, you'd be the straight arrow. You know deep down you want to do what's right. That safe code can mean a lot. Don't paint me as a hero, Jensen. I'm a regular guy. But you're right, though. I always try to do the right thing. Ha! The code is 7196. But do me a favor. Can you at least try to hack the damn thing before punching in the code? If I'm lucky, it'll be enough to throw them off. Sweet. So my new augment already worked and gave me extra information. You have to help Mrs. Reed find out more about her daughter. That's all I need for now. Okay, well that was cool. That that augmentation, that social thing is neat. And uh, that mission just got complicated as hell because... Look at this, I have now three different, four different things to look into now. I've got locate Officer Wagner's office. Chase also said that Wagner may not want to tell me much, but he thinks I can loosen the man's tongue if I get inside Wagner's office and find dirt to use against him. His office is on the third floor of the precinct. Locate the DMPD storage unit. According to Chase, all the evidence that the DMP uncovered during their investigation was moved to a cold case storage locker after the feds took over the case. I need to find that locker and take a look at the evidence. Go to the police station lobby. Chase confirmed Cassandra's suspicions about a sloppy police investigation and suggested I speak to one of the officers assigned to the case, Chet Wagner. I should be able to find Wagner inside the lobby of the Jefferson Drive precinct and locate Captain Penn's office. Chase told me that the order to close the DMPD's investigation came from higher up. If that's true, the Jefferson Drive Precinct Captain might have copies of those orders on his computer. Time to check out Captain Penn's second floor office inside the police station. 
And I assume this is the same police station where the morgue is. Yeah, Jefferson Drop. So I have a lot of stuff to do at that police station. Um, okay, well, what else was in this building? What's up with these boxes? There's boxes I could take. I could take them. I could take them out outside and use them to stack, climb things. I could take this fire extinguisher. Why? I don't know. Why not? I think it's cool that all the objects have a health bar. You can literally see how close to damaged they are. Or, you know, how close to destroyed. How damaged they are. Oh, what's all this? I have no code, but I could hack this because it's only a level one. I mean, why am I hacking into a random person's apartment? I don't know. Because it's Deus Ex. Quick save. I'm doing it. Let's hack it up. Oh, there's data nodes in this keypad? Okay, um, so the way out's down there. I want that data store. I guess... Capture. Capture. Oh, I'm screwed. Yeah, I'm gonna lose this one. Access denied. The way I handled that was not good. But I have to wait... 23 seconds. Meanwhile... gonna take that box over there. Don't mind me. System locked down. Hmm. Hopefully this doesn't get detected. It did. It got detected. I don't think I'm gonna win this race. Access denied. It always says attempts left five. Like, no matter how many attempts I make. It always says there's still five. Why is this all smoky in here? Is there, like, a fire in that apartment? Why am I taking these boxes? I don't know. Just because. I'm gonna hack this one more time attempt to hack this one more time. Oh cool, see it wasn't detected that time, that's, that's lovely. Oh, I'm screwing up here. Not gonna make it. Probably shouldn't have even bothered with fortifying. I should have just gone. Access denied. So some number of seconds remaining. That's all the time I have for this video though. Thank you for watching. Josiah plays Deus Ex, Human Revolution.
I'll see you next time.